Eight Mile takes place in the blue collar district of Detroit, Michigan. The main character, Jimmy Smith Jr., also known as B-Rabbit, just broke up with his girlfriend Janine after she told him she was pregnant. Now with no car and no other place to go, he decides to move in with his mom in the trailer park off of 8 Mile Road. Here he lived with his alcoholic mother, her abusive boyfriend, and his little sister Lily. His dad is gone, and he wishes for a real family like he once had when they lived in a nice home. What the fuck, guys? His friends help him in any way possible and are always there for him. There's DJ Iz, who always listens. Then there's Soul George, who is the rock of the group. If they respect our sisters, who we Y'all, we doing it to ourselves. Then there's Cheddar Bob, who is the typical idiot in the group, but Rabbit has an emotional connection to him because he is also the same race as Rabbit in the community. So he is someone he can confide in without feeling judged. You wanna fuck with us, huh? Fuck with us, yeah? Shut up, what the fuck are you doing, man? Where did you get that shit? And finally, there's Future, who has been there for him the longest and the person who he's closest with. Future is always positive and tries to bring Rabbit's negative attitude to that of a positive one. Moved in with his mother. Cause he ain't got no place to go. And now I'm right back in the gutter. <laughs> With a garbage bag that's full of clothes. Bust it, bust it. Cause you live at home in a trailer. Throughout the movie, Rabbit is always working on his image and tries very hard to impress others while also feeling like he isn't accepted by many. Man, you just see me, dog. I just came from the front. Man, you just fucking see me. I just went to the front. Just like everybody. Else. got a fucking problem. I think you better with me, man. shut the fuck up. He's straight, dog. He's straight. Hey, but you? Yeah. Okay, cool, future. But I think your boy got an attitude problem. He always has to prove himself to others and defends any negative comments towards himself. My friends think you're crazy. Yo, your friends don't even know me. He is almost always down on himself and doesn't easily accept any help. His behavior exhibits borderline personality disorder, which is a mental health disorder that generates significant emotional instability, which severely distorts self-image and makes the person feel worthless and fundamentally flawed. Anger, impulsiveness, and frequent mood swings may push others away, even though you may desire to have loving and lasting relationships. Look, give me nothing! Fuck you! I told you not to fucking sign me up! What the fuck? You want to fight me now? Huh? Other things he does underneath this category are he always tries to one up others, is very defensive over himself, does everything on impulse, and has anger issues. Don't you worry, Rabbit! I got you back! Hey, 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 what's up, B? Fuck with us, bitch. Shut up, bitch ass up. In many scenes, he also displays restlessness, being so nervous he starts puking, anxiety, moving his legs and feet repeatedly, constant fidgeting, and always doing something to keep himself busy. He can be diagnosed based off of this information as having generalized anxiety disorder, which is a mental health disorder that makes the person feel like they cannot relax, they startle easily, and have difficulty concentrating. Often they have trouble falling asleep or staying asleep. Physical symptoms that often accompany the anxiety include fatigue, headaches, muscle tension, muscle aches, difficulty swallowing, trembling, twitching, irritability, sweating, nausea, lightheadedness, having to go to the bathroom frequently, feeling out of breath, and hot flashes. Finally, Rabbit shows that he has a phobia of the past. A phobia is when a person has extreme anxiety and fear associated with the object or situation of avoidance. He wants to avoid talking or thinking about the past. 
I gave him that nickname. <laughs> no, I, I did. When he was when he was little, he he had buck teeth and big ears. <laughs> he was so cute, like a widow rabbit. <laughs> right, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Constantly keeping himself busy helps doing things such as listening to music, rapping, and going out every night with his friends. He is mostly avoiding thinking about his father and having to talk to Janine. He has a phobia of talking to Janine mainly because he thinks she is crazy because she made up being pregnant. He also is not looking for that kind of commitment yet because he still wants to make a demo and feels like she is getting in the way. Tell me and I'll leave you alone. It's not you, okay? Janine, it's me. It's my shit. I had to go. Why? What are you running from? Nothing. Would you just go? This concludes my case study on Bee Rabbit. For further information, stream 8 Mile on Netflix. Put your motherfucking hands up. Look, look. Now while he stands up, notice that this man...